Sponsored by AwesomeDrinks.com. Use coupon code GREEN14 and save 15% on everything you buy. Welcome to Common Man Cocktails. I'm your host, Eric Schumer, and I've got with me Ian Andrews, and we're going to make a drink. That's what we do. Again? All the time. We should make some food sometime. When Change it up. We're going to make pizza. <laughs> yeah. We're making pizza, pepperoni style. Wait, that's not a style. New York Chicago style, style pepperoni. Chicago style pepperoni. So we're not on the same page. No, no, no. <laughs> we're going to use a pork and a Chicago style in that thick crust. Yeah. Pan pizza. Pan pizza. Yeah. Pan, pan. pan pan. Oh, wait, no. That's pizza pizza. Whatever. <laughs> anyway, the Jolly Rancher. This is from Adam. He does pan pan, too. <laughs> anyway. Really? Is that like the can can? Okay. No. No. Da, 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 we are making da, 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 da. a cocktail with yeah. green apple Jolly Ranch vodka. And you're, when, and, when did you make that? And you're like, how, I don't know how to make that. Well, guess what? We have Search the videos. That's right. Search our videos. Excuse me. Or we have a playlist for vodka infusions. Mm. You can find it in there. I do. Yeah. We have a playlist for Jolly Rancher infusions. You can find it in there. Holy Christ. How many playlists do you have? I have a frick ton of playlists. At least 60. You're very well organized, Eric. Somewhat. Very well organized. A lot of my old videos aren't in them. Ha, ha, ha. So we're going to make that, it's going to be, so to, if you don't want to go watch the video, shame on you, skipping the ads next is what I'm going to hear, you can just take a bunch of green apple Jolly Ranchers, like half a bag, probably up to about here, throw in some vodka, vodka, and wait and Wait a couple hours, three, four hours, That's shake it? it every now and then, yeah, it doesn't take long, oh, wow. and you don't even have to just filter it, it's done. That's amazing. You chop it with the rest of the vodka, because... Um, I don't know why that happens. Oh, there's probably some space. I don't. Yeah, I, there's probably air in the thing. It doesn't. There must be something eyes, inside yeah. of the Jolly Ranchers because there should volume should be the same whether you're a solid or a liquid, right? Well, not necessarily. Not in the case of Jolly Rancher because when like, you're done, there's like ice room to top it takes off. Uh, like ice melts. But it. ice has it's a different. That's true. Yeah. But ice has a lot of uh, air. It takes trap. up the same volume when it's yeah exactly. But I don't know how how they make Jolly Rancher, but I'm guessing there's some air trap. They probably melt sugar. I would guess that would probably be right. Probably. And then they paint it green with dyes. Yes. <laughs> and then you get this out of it. And once you have that... Well, that's some good hypothesizing. Let's I, make a drink. All right. Theorize it up. Yeah, Jen, was talking, Jen was thinking that, weren't you? Totally. Stop yep. talking and make the drink. Yep. We're not talking about fusing hydrogen with helium to make a, a star. What we're going to do is we're going to substitute, that's however, peach schnapps for Havana Bitch Peach Vodka. And the reason for that is I don't have right. any peach shops left. I found this out when Ian told me I don't have any left. So it may be more potent than the original. Yeah, it could be. A, if we say it's a little bit more potent, there's probably a lot of bit of reason. Am I going to go too far with this? We'll wait uh, on that. Let's wait on that last ice cube. You can Hold. probably pull it off. back, dude. Hold! Hold! This is the Chicago Highball available at awesomedrace.com. Four ounces. We're going to top it with four ounces of the cranberry juice. Then we're going to garnish with an orange wedge. In blood this orange. case, mine got bloody because it's a blood orange. Gross. It's that Good thing time we held off on that ice cube, I think. The uh, orange's time. Of the month? Yeah. Really? Way to keep that PG, Derek. I, was, I, I Good stopped job. when you finished it, so I figured I might as well go with it. Okay, so. What did we get all over there? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's a dried up lemon seed. Why did I you. crushed it in my finger. I don't know. What? You could do some weird ass stuff. Man. It was there. My hand was there. It was doing nothing. You, you, you're like, oh, there's an orange seed. I might as well. Do so you think we could fit another ice cube in there? I might as well crush it. Yeah, in a second. Okay. Yeah, I'll let you <laughs> oh, that blood orange goes pretty well. Oh, it's pretty good. Kind of blends in. Oh, Jesus. This is a killer. That's Boom. It. Done. The Jolly Rancher. There you go. Hopefully it tastes like a Jolly Rancher. Let's find out. Yeah, there you have it. Boom. Mm. That's really big garnish. <laughs> Take it off. You <laughs> lose the effect. Mm -hmm. Boom, boom, and the Then you could face. actually drink it. Oh, you know what that tastes like? Jolly Rancher. Oh. Ah! <laughs> Yep. <laughs> oh my God! I was not expecting such a late, late striking shot from the whatever Sorry. that is acidity. Um. Ah, oh, I need a, a hand to get my. No, you leg can't have my hand. My my, my, my leg cross leg. Jolly Rancher, I get that. But it was a Jolly Rancher to begin with. <laughs> it's like you basically took Jolly Rancher vodka and now you made a drink called the Jolly Rancher. I mean, it's like using peach knobs and. Making a peach. Making a peach. Georgia peach or something. Mm -hmm. Right? With orange juice. This is, um... Mm. It's like a cranberry Jolly Rancher. It's a, it doesn't exist. It's like bittery. It is. It's dry, bitter. But it's sweet, um, but acidic. It's bitter. Yeah, definitely acidic. It's not bad. It's, no, it hits you right here for a second. 
Uh, it's got definitely has a green apple flavor of a Jolly Rancher. This that's there. It's dry. It doesn't taste like it's gonna kick you in the ass. Which with peach schnapps, it may be even a little. I, the peach vodka might be a better idea because the yeah. peach schnapps might just be over the top it's sweet. Yeah, you still right. get peach in there. I kind of like that with the Ivana bitch peach. Yeah, it's good. You get you get the peach in there, but you don't get you massive definitely get the peach. Yes, yeah. and you you get the pucker from the apple, the yeah. uh, Jolly Rancher. Uh, it vodka. is puckery, and it is strikingly, brilliantly. It's potent. puckery enough that it reminds me of that picture Don sent us earlier. <laughs> his wag? Of his butt. His butt. His butt. Well, not the toilet. <laughs> I just put that on Instagram. Don's toilet. I'm going to start saying Don weird pictures. <laughs> They're going to be random. It's just like, what is that? Is that pubes? Nope. Nope. It's actually a forest. Might be my chest hair. Might be my pubes. <laughs> Who knows? They all look the same to me. Um, <laughs> Let your imagination sort that one out. <laughs> this, this, then, uh, get some dry. That cranberry definitely it's dry. Definitely it dry. It's definitely yeah. dry. It's not bad. It's a, it's it's a, a dry drink. cocktail. If yeah. You can categorize a cocktail as a, a sweet, sour, uh, dry should be a category. Dry should definitely be a category. That's a, it's a dry cocktail. It does have, on an alcohol scale of 1 to 10, it's not that bad. It's probably like a 4. <coughs> 4, yeah. Um, but it could be maybe a 3 with peach schnapps instead of peach vodka, maybe. You'd have to mm -hmm. test that on your own. That's very easy to test. Just make this drink and just peach, peach schnapps. Yeah. Yeah. And Do your own research, people. Jesus has peach schnapps. Everybody has peach schnapps. That's up to um, you. <laughs> yeah, we have everything else. Derek doesn't have peach schnapps, people. He's got two more of these over there. You know what? No peach schnapps. Screw you! <laughs> hey, I'm just I, know, I can't wait. I, yeah, these are I know. Burgers. I, <laughs> I'm a pretty freaking genius. I can't believe out of all this stuff, no I don't have schnapps. peach schnapps. You want a question today? Do you, you guys have peach schnapps to it. send me? I don't question know how many day. people are going to be able to answer this, but what is the best jazz song you've heard of? Oh my god, what's the best jazz, jazz song you've heard oh. of? I don't even I don't even know what the worst jazz song I've heard of is. <laughs> tomato Tomato? That's a jazz song? Yeah, it's Louis Armstrong. Who sings Tomato Tomato? You just said it. One step ahead of you. I'm just two steps behind. I like, um, uh, who do I got my jazz Spotify stuff? You, come on. I got a jazz playlist. Are you kidding me? Yeah. No, no I'm not no? kidding you. No? This guy has a jazz. Okay. Things oh, we've yeah. learned about Ian this week. I like Tom Waits, too. He, as a kid. Jazzy, oh, you like Tom Waits? I love Jeez. Tom Waits. Oh, You're, my father and brother listen to Tom Waits. I'm Tom Waits is amazing. Tom, Tom. Oh, it's coming. Uh, uh, amazingly, <laughs> oh my god, my ears. Ooh, I like Over the Rainbow. If you don't know who Tom Waits is, if you got Spotify or whatever, look up Tom Waits. He's like a classic guy. Dream a little you dream of me. Okay. When Listen. you're smiling, the whole world smiles. Things we've That's learned right. good. about Ian this week. First off, as a child, he read books for fun. He read books. And, and there were books that, like, I would have read The Lord of the Rings and The Hobbit while he's reading read Fahrenheit 451. I Dragonlance books. So no, that was later on. When, oh, in high school, I read those. But before that, did you read these other books before that? I don't know. Yeah, he did. You know what? Keep teasing me because Tom Waits is right here. <laughs> now we learn not only does he know about jazz, but he can draw from that. No! He can draw from that actual jazz playlists that he put on his Spotify on purpose. <laughs> it wasn't like, oh, I typed jazz instead of jizz. You were looking for Tom. Is that Everyday Drinkers up there? Huh. No. Oh, what are you talking about? Oh, everything you can. Yeah, it's not every. Yeah, you don't want this. This is a weird, weird album. You don't want that. No, all Tom Waits albums are weird albums. That's what makes yeah, Tom Waits Tom Waits. It's like Bob Dylan. He's not the best singer in the world. I don't know if you noticed. No, but no. Tom Waits. Tom Waits he, is amazing. Put him on the voice. That guy's going home day one. Let's see. Done. No, 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 no. He's got a. He's got character. Yeah, he's got character he's got that he character can take home right. with him. In His a songs suitcase. are great. Bad liver and a broken heart. Just because you can make a cool name song doesn't mean it has Warm to be Warm beer, cold women. It's great. <laughs> Listen. So, uh, you can answer that he's question. He's been on soundtracks. He's been in movies. He's great. It's great. Keep him in there. Pasties in a G-string. That's happening. Listen to this. We're going to get pulled off of YouTube or something. Damn. This is wrong. Like, the, <laughs> and I'm seeing that album oh, cover. The piano has been drinking. I, I know. Brilliant. This. I I know. I I've heard of them all. Oh, sure. 
my father has the stupid Matt albums. And Bob Dylan. And Bob Dylan. <laughs> and, 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 and like just crazy stuff like that. <laughs> oh my god! Alright, we're done! <laughs> Yeah, you would. Get some echo. I'm gonna hit. I'm gonna hit that right. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna drown you in your sorrows, Mr. Jazzman. We're, we're gonna have some issues with ASCAP or something. ASCAP? Is that like as? Is it ASCAP? Uh, I don't know. It's it's DMCA It's people? the license you get at a bar to play songs. Oh, I don't know what it is. Here. They, they would just pull it right off YouTube, or they just take the ad revenue probably. No, um, well, let's not do that. <laughs> Thank you, Adam, for the Jolly Rancher. And Thanks, uh, for those that want to talk about jazz, you can. And you know what? If you don't like jazz, tell us why. I can tell you why. Hmm. I don't like jazz. It bores me. I, right. I don't like the freestyle jazz. I, I don't like freestyle. When, when like there's five instruments up there all doing their own thing. Yeah. Play together, people. It's a band. <laughs> the band means together. <laughs> I, you know, I, I guess no I'd have single to be instrument in band, people. The only, yeah. the only time I've looked Everybody for Everybody solo! <laughs> I, when I was downloading, because YouTube has some free background tracks you can add to stuff. Sure. And they, I went to the jazz section, because when I was making the Curtis video for Wink and Nod, I needed something in the background. Wink and Nod is speakeasy. You know, I figured jazz would fit. Yeah. So the two songs I picked were jazzy. That I understand, like it fits well, fits well in movies. Um, yeah, but yeah. I wouldn't be driving down the road listening to jazz. It's you know never. Gonna I happen. have made a whole trip to Maine, like a three or four hour drive listening to Tom Waits I, because he has a couple albums that are about driving. So it's like great. Really? Yeah. The I listened to like the Disturbed. Heart of Night, his first album. I did. I did put Maroon Five on random once. The couple of the albums. That's brave. Went all the way down <laughs> Connecticut and back. I love Maroon Five. Uh, I mean, that's the craziest thing I've done. <laughs> Ever. Yeah. Normally, I just listen to podcasts. Wait for it, people. Yeah! <laughs> that's your elbow. I know. Anyway, we've wasted enough of your time today. We've wasted enough of our time. Every day, you should come. Go awesome eat yourself. Drinks. Awesome drinks. Go to Make Chicago yourself a Jolly Highball. Rancher. Make yourself some green apple Jolly Rancher vodka. Right. And key to the Chicago Highball, nice weighted bottom, which means better quality glass. It just happens to be that way. I don't know. So it's not gonna tip over as easy. No, it actually has to do with how they're how they're produced. I it just makes a better shit up. No, well, you can do that. Anyway, anyway, we're done. We're teaching you how to drink. <laughs>